Hello guys and today I'm going to show you the gaming performance on the new Intel Iris Xe graphics on the 11th gen Intel CPUs. So without any further ado, let's get started. The Intel Iris Xe graphics are a long overdue upgrade for integrated graphics on Intel Core series of processors. These new 11th gen CPUs come under the Tiger Lake name and in this video, we'll be testing out the laptop versions of these new Tiger Lake 11th gen CPUs. The older graphics that came before this were called the Intel HD graphics and they were mostly underpowered on their own without a discrete GPU. The Intel Iris graphics are said to be around twice the performance in terms of graphics when compared to last gen and as performance comparable to the MX350. For this test, we'll be using a mid-range laptop with an Intel Core i5-1135G7 processor, 8GB of RAM and a 256GB SSD. The games that will be tested on this will include GTA 5, Red Dead Redemption 2, Shadow of the Tomb Raider and Mafia Definitive Edition. So with that said, let's get into the results of the GPU. So in conclusion, the Intel Iris graphics on the new 11th gen processors are true to its claim and do offer decent gaming performance. You can play most of the new games on low settings at 720p with playable frame rates but you shouldn't expect every game to run well on this. Right now, the price of the 11th gen laptops is a bit high but when it eventually lowers down, I think this could actually be a pretty good value. Overall, Intel has finally caught up with the Ryzen integrated GPUs and you can now finally game on Intel graphics. So that's it for the video guys, thanks for watching. 
please like share and subscribe to the channel and hope you enjoyed the video and i'll see you guys in the next video bye